guys, I'm that fat guy. It is Thursday and I'm at work early enough that the lights aren't on yet and it's uh, raining outside so it's quite dark. I've got a uh, coffee here at the ready and I'm just kind of just walking around just getting some steps in before I start my shift today. <sighs> a little longer than a few minutes later. So it's a little bit past two o'clock and I'm in the car. I've just finished uh, my shift for today. Work was, uh, yeah, it was all right. Like, I mean, it was just busy. I had a two hour long uh, training session and um, for this yeah, project I'm part of. And yeah, um, it went by pretty quickly because of that. And uh, it's currently raining, uh, which means it's gonna be wet and soggy football tonight. Parramatta Eels playing the storm. Uh, you'll be watching this tomorrow, so the game already would have happened. Um, I'm tipping the storm, unfortunately, even though I'm a Parramatta supporter. I'm not wearing a Paris shirt. I've decided to go for an old Lonsdale shirt that I actually picked up in um, Piccadilly Circus uh, back when I was in uh, uh, in London when I was uh, 21. And this shirt um, only just fit me then. Like, it was a pretty, it was an all right fit. This is now like a kind of like, you know, I could probably go a size down, but it would be like a tight fit, but uh, yeah, this is um, a nice fitting shirt now, and because I'm a hoarder, I held on to it, and uh, I thought it was a good shirt, because I wanted to wear the jersey, but I had that project meeting, so I thought uh, maybe it's a bit more apt, or a bit more professional to wear a, uh, a polo instead, so um, not Eels branded, but Eels colours, blue and gold, baby, but yeah, I'm going to get on the road, I'm going to go get Alyssa, and um, yeah, then it's just the afternoon. Oh yeah, step up date, uh, 5,237. Let's go! So I'm back at home, I picked up Alyssa, we've done her homework. Um, I've had to open up a new bag of mango. That only leaves me with a couple left, um, but I need to do the bag to box transfer. I actually had to do this this morning, but uh, I didn't have time to do the bag to box transfer. Super fine, the mango powder. So it's about 4.30 and I'm only up to 5,963 steps. Because it's been raining, I haven't been able to walk you know, to Alyssa's school and pick her up. So I'm literally just walking around the house trying to get more steps. So this is my path around the house. I walk to the front door, turn around, walk into the kitchen. Like I would do so many times when I was a lover, walk out of the kitchen. Then I go up the stairs. Into the bathroom. Turn around. And down the stairs. And to the front door. And repeat, up to 7,208 steps. Anyway, you can get your steps in. Uh, I'm just going to do some kitchen cleaning and uh, then we're going to pick up Angela. Uh, we've made an executive decision tonight that we're going to have uh, Guzman. So we're going to have a burrito bowl tonight and uh, probably after that I'll finish off my steps of the day because I got my live stream at eight o'clock where I'm going to be uh, watching the footy and doing a live stream so hopefully it all goes well. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Anyway, I'm going to get to it. Now up to 8,049 steps. It's amazing how quickly they all add up. Just steps. That's all you need. Steps. Steps. My dinner, chicken, burrito bowl, and that's fresh jalapenos. Jalapenos. Jalops. It's gonna be hot. So I finished my dinner and now I'm out walking in the rain uh, to get the final bit of steps in to get to my 11,000 goal. And uh, yeah, there's a very constant rain like this. Um, so uh, 
I wouldn't be surprised if the, the local park that I walk through to get to the station in the morning will be flooded. Um, it's got very poor drainage and after all these years they just still haven't fixed it. Uh, especially after last year. Last year was like like crazy floods and I think it was around this time last year. Uh, I'll see I'll see whether I can dig up dig dig up a clip. But um yeah. Crazy rain. Anywho, getting there. You're not gonna get me, clever. Okay, so it is a little bit before eight o'clock and I'm about to start my live stream. I've got my uh whole setup here. I don't really want to show any of the screen because believe it or not, I've been, um, they took down a video for copyright because I showed like, I don't know, 12 seconds of a game once. So I'm not doing that again, but, uh, yeah, getting ready for the live stream. It's going to be a bit of fun. I'm up to 12,761 steps. So I made my target for the day. Um, but yeah, I'm really not expecting the Eels to win tonight, but Hey, gotta be faithful. Later. Parramatta have done it. Parramatta have done it. Parramatta have done it. Parramatta have beat the Melbourne Storm in round two, the reigning premiers. Everyone wrote Parramatta off saying, no, no, Parramatta, you don't do that. And Parramatta have won. Oh, wow. What a game last night. Uh, Parramatta Eels got up and beat the Storm. Um, what a grinding game. I was so happy with the result. I was like losing my voice. Um, yeah, it's now Friday morning. I'm walking off to work and, uh, had fun doing the live stream. Um, didn't get huge numbers there last night, mainly because, uh, it's mainly a weight loss channel. So, um, I don't plan on doing lots of those, uh, footy streams. Um, I may only do like, I may only do them if the Eels game falls at the time that I'm going to be doing my you break your live stream. Um, maybe the state of origin, but otherwise guys, it'll be mainly kept to the weight loss aspect, but I had a lot of fun. That's the most important thing. And uh, the Eels won. So yeah, getting on with this day. It's going to be a long day. It's my uh, long shift. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully it goes by quickly. But uh, guys, thank you for watching this video. I do love every single one of you. There's nothing you can do about it. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys.